Alt text on Amazon is like a sneaky fox. It's something that's subtle. You don't see it, but it's really important because the fox comes out of nowhere to grab the hedgehog. My name is Stephen Pope. I'm the founder of My Amazon Guy. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to use a tool that shows you the alt text of any listing on Amazon very quickly to help you along your way. Uh, this is cool because I sell soaps on Amazon and I want to know, like, hey, what's my number one competitor up to right now? Dr. Squash, who sells soaps as well. Well, I come in and install this little image alt text viewer and it tells me exactly what they're doing and we're off to the races. You can download this yourself for free. It's called Image Alt Text Viewer on the Chrome Web Store. Keep in mind there are like a hundred alt text viewer tools out there. Any one of them will do just fine. So here's what we're trying to accomplish. We're, we're over at an Amazon listing and we're looking at all of the contents. Now, just so you know, the only content that can show alt text that you can set yourself is below the fold. So all these images up here, safely ignore those. We can't do anything about them. But as we scroll down, when we get to this section from the brand, this is where the brand story is. If you don't have one of those yet, watch this video next. Got to have a brand story. And this product description section, which is the A plus content section, also formerly called EBC or Enhanced Brand Content. In here, you can click the button for the alt text to pop in and out. And this just basically lets you know what's going on. So if we scroll down, is Dr. Squash optimizing its alt text for its logo? Absolutely not. They basically had a designer come in here and just type in Dr. Squash logo. So their SEO is nowhere close to being maximized. Hopefully my competitor doesn't watch this video and take action. Now, the other thing that you could do if you are worried that somebody is using your own trademark in their alt text terms, you could enable this and basically do this. Control F, Age of Sage. Do I show up anywhere on the page? I do not. So they're not using my trademark against my will or my express permission, so I can't report them and get them in trouble. Dang. But maybe one of you watching this sees that happen, and if that happens, leave a comment here about how you caught one of your sneaky Chinese likely competitors who has used your trademark name in the alt text, go in and file a trademark infringement report, list their ASIN, and show a screenshot of the alt text as proof, and boom, you're going to get them taken down until they remove that is. They'll come back up. All right, so we can come in here and see what all of the alt text is set. Dr. Squash, so details and ingredients, none of this is set whatsoever. How about the brand story? We come in here, classic bar soap, manly soap for men natural. Yep, that's optimized. So they've got their brand story optimized pretty good here, uh, but they didn't optimize all of the other good stuff. So if you go to one of my listings right now, let's go over to my own soaps, and we click in and optimize with the alt text button and start to scroll down. Here you can see, uh, looks like a loss. Let's enable it one more time. Here you can see I've also done that. I've even thrown some Spanish terms into the alt text. And for those that don't know, each photo has a hundred characters that you can set for each individual photo. And you can set it, it's called keywords of images in the back end of Amazon. I'll show you that in a second. But first, here's all of the different locations. You can see, boom, there's alt text there, there's alt text there, there's alt text there, 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 A, B, C, D, E, F. It's all over the place. Even these product grid locations, all of these individual photos can be set for their own individual alt text. You want to optimize these all custom and have Spanish in a couple or at least one of them. Uh, features, benefits, top keywords you're trying to rank on, you name it, go in and focus in on it. All right, so we're going to pop into the A plus content manager. And in here, we're going to go look at, say, my last brand story. And inside of the brand story, we're going to go look at each individual photo and see how it's optimized. So we're going to hit the edit button here and we're going to click into each photo. So let's look at this one, for example, hit edit, image keywords goes right there. So you can set all kinds of keywords and make sure you maximize that out because that is additional locations that you can put more keywords to optimize and rank your products. Going back to the detail page with the brand story right here, did you know that there is a maximum of 9,600 characters of alt text you can stuff in the brand story. This does not even include the product descriptions. I'm just talking alt text behind each photo because there's so many different modules that you can pop in and check out. 
So this is why this is so powerful, because if you're trying to take your listing to the next step, you really have to understand which products are ranking for what. So if we pop over to Helium 10 here uh, and look at Cerebro, we can see what keywords this listing is indexing for. So I am indexing organically for 2,300 keywords. That's pretty good, not half shabby. I'm sponsored ads, just over a thousand. This stays within my golden ratio of one sponsored keyword to two organic. And actually my organic is slightly outperforming the golden ratio. It's almost a platinum ratio, if you were. And that's, that's gonna make me really happy because that means my organic is indexing well. I'm gonna show up for number one for artisan soap, number one for cold press soap, and many, many other keywords. Couldn't complain at all about that. Pretty satisfied with the keyword rankings we're seeing on screen here. All of this is made possible by offering a good product plus SEO behind the scenes, like that sneaky fox. Every time you see my artisan soap up there, chances are my alt text is what helped you find it on Amazon. Check out my other videos here for other SEO tips, including my SEO masterclass. You're not going to want to miss that.